Oh, but I thought it was 1985, but then you, you look too old. I look better than you. How long have you been sitting there? Long enough. How are you feeling? Never better. Surfing the porn channels. I'm doing research for you. I'm looking for experimental treatments for your condition. There's some really fascinating studies coming out of Indonesia and South Africa and the Netherlands, actually. You're, you're hacking into the World Health Organization. No, no hacking. That's for amateurs. Oh. Anna Devane stealing government secrets from an ICU room. Nothing I haven't done before. Doctors here aren't good enough for you? No, they're excellent. Our daughter being one of them. But, you know, everyone can use a little help every now and again. Besides, I'm really good at getting into places most people don't even bother trying. That you are, my dear. We're going to beat this one. We've tackled a lot worse. He did what? Robin, the whole point of doing yoga is to manage our stress. Fine, namaste. Now tell me what happened. He slept with Claire. Are you kidding me? How do you know this? Well, I confronted her, and she very casually told me. <gasps> to your face? Yeah, but she didn't know. Of course she didn't know, because he's an ass. Ugh! I mean, I always knew he was a jerk. I always knew that something like this could happen, but... I'm gonna kill... I'm going to kill him. Why are you so calm right now? Who says I'm calm? I went home last night and tore up my apartment. I'm really sorry. Me too. Does, um... Julia know that you know? Not yet. What are you going to do? I honestly have no idea. Patrick, can I speak to you for a second? Yep. What can I do for you? I have some bad news. Uh, remember that skinhead that you threw out of the hospital last night? Yeah. They found him dead this morning. And they're saying you're responsible. Did he get into another fight when he left here? No, he went straight home. Something must have been wrong with him because they found him dead this morning. Internal injuries. And now his friends are claiming that you refused him service. No, he refused to be helped by anybody that wasn't white. No, uh, you, you were here, son. You saw that. Yes, I did. They're right. What? His friends. They're right. I left this hospital without making sure that he had a thorough examination. I'm the one that told him to leave, Jagger. This is my responsibility. What do you need from me? You need a statement or what? It's not like that. Can I talk to you in private, please? Of course. Patrick. Yeah. The Bureau is very concerned. This guy was the leader of a militant group. Okay. Very well organized. They could take out his death on you and the rest of the staff here at General Hospital. Jagger, are you are you saying that FBI thinks it might retaliate? It's a possibility. It does. Now look, I've talked to the board. I asked for more security, and they agreed. Okay. I'll head up the whole team. Great. Yeah. Um, whatever you need, you have our full cooperation. Good. Because for a while, GH might not be safe for anyone. Dad. Hey, honey. Dad, how are you feeling? Always in fighting shape, I'll tell you that much.
Um, the fluid in his lungs hasn't subsided. All right. Which means we're looking at full onset pneumonia. Plus his body is having trouble fighting off the infection because of the colon tear. So what's the treatment? Well, the treatment is, we have him on the most rigorous course of antibiotics that we can, but his, his fever is still dangerously high. So. We not talk about me like I'm a piece of furniture. I'm sorry, Dad. How much time? Dad. Dad, you can't think of oh. it like that. I gotta know. How much time do I have to fight this? The next 48 hours are going to be critical. I'm so sorry, Daddy. There's nothing else I can do. 